All right, uh, so we're back and our town still sucks, but we're well on our way to not being in Sucksville. So we have a shield now. What's the problem? Uh, what's the problem with me making armor here? Oh, right, we gotta build it to the forge. I really like this chapter already, it's nice. Okay, so we don't have finest fur, but I can make iron armor, that's good. Okay, and... Oh, we need a steel broadsword, we need coal. I guess I'll head for that while tossing holy water. We should probably restock on holy water at some point. I'll do that later. I'm gonna slowly fill this out. At some point, this entire area is going to look beautiful. Until then, I'm just glad that there's grass. We haven't really had grass for the past two chapters. And, um... We haven't had grass for the past two chapters, and I've been kind of disappointed about that, because, like... It looks nice. Okay, so that's iron over here. Ah. Wow, this coal really was super close to close to base. And luckily we should be able to just clobber not straight through all of this. You will become mine, oh iron. Or coal. And so I will have steel. I kinda I really messed that one up. That's okay. I don't care. We also have a lot of dirt blocks to build with. Uh Let's go up a, a level and finish flattening this one out. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to think of my plan here. Unlike all the previous ones, we don't really have much of a, like, uh... They start a farm yet. Can I start a farm yet on this chapter? I haven't seen any I haven't seen any crops that look farmable, which is part of it. I have a bunch of mushrooms on a stick which I've been pretty reliant on. Oh, hey, there's a there's a little shit camp over here. We should uh take a look at that in a second. Let's uh let's eat some shrooms on a stick so we don't starve to death. Uh Yeah, I can always go back and talk to the to the old man and I believe eat some beard uh if we need to. Right. I can Spin to win from here. Yeah, the. Oh, I'm so glad we picked up a. Uh, I'm I'm so glad we picked up a, a. Uh, what am I thinking? Uh, colossal coffer early on. I always hate that be beginning section here. Oh, okay, good. Like uh, I always hate the beginning section in this game when there's nothing, uh, for like the longest time. Uh, no. Uh, no, uh, no colossal coffer, no, like, base resources, and you're just, just kind of slogging. This feels really good. And the only problem is there's, like, nobody here, so it's awkward. This is the last game I'm playing tonight. Oh, hell yeah. I'm not playing anymore. After this. Luckily, I'm going to be playing this for a while. I love DQB. I don't know. I, I, the more I think about it, the more this game actually gets pretty damn close to being, uh, my top game of 2000. 2016. Like, more than Scrap Mechanic. I like Scrap Mechanic, but... Oh, shit. We're out of... We don't have enough ha for a hammer. Alright, let's collect what we got. Uh, we've got a sword, so I'll, I'll come back in a second. Um, But I, I just think this game is actually that good. We still get a lot of coal here. Um, But let's, let's toss this for the time being. Is the Bloodstone useful? Apart from decoration? Don't think so. It's also nice that the uh, the resources are actually collected high up here. We might be able to make um, a heal herb salad. Come to think of it, if I remember right, that was some that was a recipe that I was capable of cooking along the way. Where are we? I want to look at the the map. So Cole and Gallenholm are. I have no way of navigating this map. I never paid enough attention. Uh, the bottom right is definitely the diseased area. The bottom area, I believe, was, um, Cantlin. Uh, so Cole and Gallenholm must have been the top set. Yeah. They're all, they're all connected. Yeah, so we're over here, and there's, there are four islands. Okay, so we will be teleporting a bunch. Uh, the really small one must be where, where the old man and the princess are. Anyway, uh, we've got these guys. Switch back to our sword and see if we can fight these guys, because there's a chest and a cooking fire. Ow, this wizard hurts. 
Oh shit, I can't hurt him. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna come back later. I don't think I don't think we're gonna be able to beat him as we currently are. Uh drop these bones on the ground, then let's purify the bones. I don't know how I'm turning bones into uh flowers, but that's that's an awesome superpower. It's a bit weird, but I ain't questioning it. Okay. Can you imagine if you could turn, like, maybe not bones? Well, you'd actually be a great mortician, maybe? Funeral director? Just, you know, people show up with their deceased and you're like, what kind of flowers do you want? And they're like, roses, and that, you know, that's actually a great name for, like, a, or that's a great premise for, like, a, a short story of some variety. Oh, shit, I am out of holy water. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay, um, did I get the cook fire? I think I got... I didn't get the cook fire. Damn it. All right, whatever. Um, we did get we did get what we need though. Uh, we need another sledgehammer here. Okay, and let's make. Let's make some amount of steel. That is not much steel. Okay, Grim Fandango has a similar concept. To this, or I'm forgetting now. Okay, I'm gonna run out of steel here. But we'll probably need more of it. Okay, items. Oh, let's drop all this stuff off. Yeah, we're gonna need to get more... ...of everything along the way. Okay, uh... Oh, I totally forgot to put on my iron. Our armor. Anyway, let's get the, uh, the steel shield. Oh, the skulls to flower story. Oh, really? I know there was the one that was like trash to uh there was there was trash to trees in Love Ueki, but I never I never watched that one. It seemed interesting, but I just I couldn't get into it. Anyway, uh items. Let's sort let's put away the iron shield unless I need it. We have a steel broadsword, two stone swords. I'll probably be fine without the stone swords for the time being. I'm just gonna store them instead of deleting them though. Let's get another hammer or two, though. We got a lot of iron, and we can probably work with this. Okay. Okay, this should work. Let's see. So I've got a much bigger sword. Oh, right. Uh, do I still have that bucket? Oh, no, but we do have this chest over here. Possible to make a final, final battle defense fortress. Build our rooms. Okay, you keep asking that, and it gets really annoying. But the answer is yes, I am doing I am doing a crazy defense fortress. Yeah, pro tip for anybody watching my YouTube content or streams ever, repeating the same thing over and over again actually does get really annoying for me. If I don't give you an answer, it's because I don't, like, I don't feel like responding. It just gets, I get cantankerous listening to it. Um... Especially when it's said, like, more than twice. Like, twice, you know, it's okay. But still. I don't know. I think I'm also in a really grumpy mood today. It's, uh... It's getting to be the winter time, and everybody... Everybody's always just a little bit, like, um... Sensitive. M me, especially. I have, um... I'm not gonna say I have issues with se seasonal depression, because I... I don't really have issues with seasonal depression so much as just... Um... I get... I get really stressed out really easily by um, by just things when I'm like this. Oh, we can make divine salts. We need to figure out what they do. Oh, gets rid of curses. That's not super helpful here. Okay, we might as well sleep while we're while we're here. Um, I don't know. Like, part of it is uh. Whatever I, like, whatever I experience is, like, nowhere close to people that, you know, experience the much more, like, I guess, in-depth version of depression and stuff. And I always feel a little bit guilty for talking about, like, seasonal depression because I know, like, what I do experience is, n like, peanuts in comparison to the real thing. Um, and so I, was, I always try and, like, kind of temper it because... 
I just get really stressed out and like angry, and sometimes I get like I I get sad or whatever, and you know it's a lot closer to the real thing. But a lot of the times I know that like whatever I'm experiencing is like not even remotely close to um to real depression, and and I always feel bad for like I don't know. It's like one of those where uh you're suffering from like something specific, and somebody else is like, oh yeah, you know I I'm feeling sad now, and it's just like no, you don't get it. Um, and like I was. I'm, I'm always kind of, like, trying to sympathize, but I know it's never quite the same. Like, I, I know some friends with, uh, some very real mental illnesses, and I was like, I can't, I can't, like, sympathize with that in the slightest. All I can do is be a cool dude that, you know, doesn't judge you for it. Or, you know, is rather forgiving when, when these things happen. And, wow, we do damage now. I hope I can get the, uh, the crit... Good thing. I'd say that's a form of depression. Oh yeah, I'm sure. It's just it's one of those where like, I I prefer to to be polite and uh, downplay what I've got just because I know there are people that have it like a ten times worse than me. Um, and that's kind of the way it'll always be. Cause I, I'm not gonna say I used to be the kind of person that would definitely like be like, oh yeah, you know, I I, I suffer from this or that. And, you know, I, I totally understand what you're going through. And the reality is, no, nah, no, nah, I don't. I, I'm a dude. Actually, I I will admit, I probably have a pretty hard time empathizing with people at this point, to some degree. Oh, man, I get really I get really cranky whenever I see people show up to my YouTube videos or streams, being like, eh, homework's so hard. I'm like, I've been there, man. You haven't even touched college yet, and you're whining about, what, middle school homework? Ugh. <laughs> uh, that is that is a bad, that is a ba bad place to come from. Not because, like... Um, it's, I'm, I'm wrong. I'm not wrong. Middle school is way easy in comparison to, like, full calculus or, like, whatever workload you're gonna have in college. Relish middle school if you're watching this and in middle school at the same time. Well, okay, don't be watching this while you're in middle school. That, that, that's a bad, probably. I don't know. Anyway. Huh. Plus, it's also one of those where it's, like, I feel mild amounts of guilt for having a... F Comparatively pretty sweet uh, life or whatever, and then being like, near depression. Oh yeah, now we do damage. All right, ooh, we got a thing. We got our first first cook fire and a bold banner. Wait, are you serious? Wait, I can make it. Oh, bold banner is different. And we also get this. Can't really confirm these around. Yep, nope, or not confirm. I can't really convert. Hey, speaking of, we got food now. Still haven't found any plumberries yet, which is a bit unfortunate because I could seriously use some. Um, but there are mushrooms that grow out grow out here ish. Uh, I will will say though, sometimes seasonal depression is like super problematic. Uh oh, what was it? When I was like jobless. Back in, like, the end of 2013, that was... those were rough. Uh, no, nothing quite, uh, says depression like being unemployed and, uh, and being, uh, you know, suffering from that kind of business. I, uh, I would not do that again if I ever had the choice. That's why I'm maybe always a little bit, uh, too over-eager about my, uh, my YouTube career and always, like, as... Uh, aggressive as I am about it because I never want to go through like being jobless again and I always like every once in a while I hear about people like getting laid off or whatever and just having the hardest time and I'm like I get that I don't get it as much as I probably should but I get that and it's awful let's see but yeah am I planning on cheesing the enemies here oh hell yeah yeah, um, somebody told me about an unbreakable type of block around here that I can get. And, uh, I'm going to cover the entire town in un semi-unbreakable blocks. Let's see. In high school right now, the workload isn't, isn't even that much worse. The only reason why your workload is worse is because of, um, a bad math teacher. Oh, I've had ba bad math teachers. That's, that's... Bad math teachers are the worst. I had I had three bad math teachers in high school. Two, really. Uh, w one was in eighth grade. She was terrible. And then um, 
junior year of high school, I had I had one that was a lawyer, and he graded his test like a lawyer. And I didn't know I hated lawyers until he he taught math. Seriously, he was he actually like got a jury of students to solve disputes for him, uh, kind of like court. It was really weird and like did not belong in a classroom setting. But he had a small jury of uh, his his uh, low ed like kind of C list. Uh, there, there was like three levels of students in my school, and um, he taught he taught all of them, but specifically he had like a specific it was called what B two or something. He had his B two class. It, there was like A A one B one uh, A one A two B one B two pretty much, and he got his uh, he got his. Uh, his B2 students who, like, don't care about anything. These are the kids who, like, drop out. And he was he was getting them to be the jury. You could not get those kids to give a shit about anything if you tried. And so he, uh, he was like, What do you th uh, what number do you think this is? And, like, I'm in the room and the guy looks at it and he shrugs. And then he turns back to me and it's like, He can't figure it out, therefore, um, I can't figure it out either. Even though he knows for a fact it's a 4, because it's the only thing that makes sense. And then he proceeded to drop my test from an A minus down to a solid C. Oh, I hated that man so much, and I loved the fact that he looked so bewildered when I got the uh, the high school math award. Like I was the first person to, re to receive it, and he would just look so confused because he always was like kind of putting me down, being like, "You can't do this." In reality, I just didn't know how to draw fours the way he liked it because in California they uh, given me detention because uh, they given me detention. Because I I had been drawing fours a different way, the way he liked uh, to draw fours, and so, um, yeah, fuck fuck that guy. The previous teacher couldn't teach at all. Like she literally, uh, she was literally like incapable of teaching. Uh, she just handed people the book and told them to learn from it, and then had the students that finished first teach. And like the reality is, like this wasn't hard. It was just a pain in the ass. That's kind of the nice thing about college. Say what you want about college, but it's ultimately kind of fair as long as you pick a good program. High school, you don't really get a good choice of. Your 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 parents kind of get the, the choice for you, which sucks. Because there are some pretty ass astastic high schools out there. Um, but, uh, like, college, yeah, I, I did end up picking some pretty bad teachers. I got some pretty bad courses that had me working, like, nine hours a week each I don't know that was those were those were rough days I didn't enjoy that that much but like bad teachers totally exist I'm not, not ever I I don't want to like downplay that but I don't know it's it's one of those where I guess part of it is I didn't work my ass off that that hard in um I didn't work my ass off that hard in in high school because I knew I didn't care it's not that I was, like, one of those people that was just like, eh, this doesn't matter in my future, I'm not going to do it. But it was one of those where it's like, I knew that it didn't really matter for me to get into all AP classes, so I only got into the AP class I liked, which was calculus. Uh, because I actually really like math. Um, five more holy waters? Does that mean I only have five left? I haven't been paying attention to the count. Uh, no, I got 75. I'm in a rush. Okay, um... Let's see. Can I make a can I make a brick barbecue? We need castle walls. Can I make that? Huh, I can. Ooh, requires iron though. That's rough. At least we don't have brick. I actually really like the castle wall design here. Like this Aesthetically, this is my favorite chapter. My only disappointment is, um, it's, uh, the only disappointment I have with this chapter is, uh, is the fact that I don't have townspeople already. Because I would kind of really love to have some townspeople to do work shit for me. Okay, well, whatever, we'll get to that in a second. I'm gonna... Oh, there's... Oh, jeez, there's foundations? How much do I give a damn about that? Surprisingly more than I should. Yeah, let's go get, let's go get, make some foundations. We're gonna just make a bunch of, uh, 
walls to convert up and over. Uh, okay, so let's make some castle foundations, then we'll do the cladding. At least we'll have plenty of both-ish. I just gotta get... Oh yeah, there's also castle tiles. Oh, is there no... There's no castle tile... Oh wait, no, 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 no... Huh. I can't do castle foundation cladding. That's dumb. Maybe we get it later on. But that, I don't like that. Alright, whatever. I'll just deal with it for the time being. Honestly, I'm probably going to tear this entire place up. Um, because... Uh, we're going to line the, we're gonna make this base invincible and in the sky. There's a small amount of water, which I will probably replace at some point, but, um... Uh, yeah, there's a small amount of water, which I'm probably going to... Well, no, I'll probably keep the water there, um, but I'm gonna cover it in semi-invincible blocks. We'll probably just have this, like, crazy central... Uh, tower type thing and we'll go from there, but for the time being I'm gonna preserve this castle as much as I can just because it's good Just because it looks nice. Oops. Oh, this is a good remix. I Always feel bad for saying this is a good remix when people obviously can't hear it, but that's okay. Anyway, we built a room. Yay! Now let's make it not look like ass Let's put away all this stuff. There's a lot of this, but yeah, we have we have mushrooms We've got all that we need to make a, a proper castle here. I should probably actually convert, um... Several things up. Okay. Uh, do we have a chest? No. Let's go make a... Let's go make a chest. Oh, yeah. I really am starting to starve. There we go. Go talk to the princess every once in a while. Oh, you get more quests from time to time. You mean to tell me she does... The princess will never come to this castle. Am I am I really alone here? I'm gonna be really disappointed if no one comes to join me here along the way. I'd love I'd love a uh, a quick answer on that one because if I'm alone, then I'm gonna build this place like garbage. Oh, interesting. We can't make braziers. Oh, I guess I'll make this for the time being. We'll just make a, a basic kitchen. Not that we have townspeople to work this, but still. Okay. She will come. It's just after something. You don't recover. recall what. My bet is I have to get the, uh, the standard planted. Okay, what are we missing? Oh, a pot. Whatever. Don't care. So we got fried frog, frog stool, which is 20% or shrooms on a stick. Well, I can make a crap ton of shrooms on a stick, which is great. Uh, don't I still need the the town flag? Yeah, that's kind of the that's the goal here. Okay, let's store the cladding and let's keep going. I got plenty of holy water for the time being. I wouldn't mind getting more, but um, I heard that the the sta the flag is straight south in some kind of fortress. So I figured we'd go take a look at that. At least this area is starting to look really nice, though, with all the, uh, purified water. Okay, yeah, people will join me once I get the banner. Good. Oh, shit, that's it. Well, yeah, I don't think I can get any better equipped than this. So that's okay. Oh. I really wish, uh, time would actually pause. Well, I'm here. Oh, he lost interest. Interesting. Not used to them losing interest like that. I think I'm only gonna bother to harvest mushrooms. I don't know why I'm only getting actual mushrooms instead of the toadstools. The to toadstools are perfectly reasonable. The one problem I have with this is, um, I can't see shit. Oh, right. We should probably have actually loaded up on some healing items. I just realized we're kind of carrying nothing. 
Okay, yeah, let's let's cut down some medicinal bushes. I totally forgot about uh, this. So let's purify and let's medicinize, because yeah, I'm going to die if I if I attempt this right now. I mean, I might be able to cheese it by running away and not fighting anything, uh, but I think we're gonna have to fight a boss to get the standard. Hell, we might even have to fight Erdrick to get the standard. I'm a little bit worried about that. I mean, we'll probably be fine, especially if I stack enough healing items. The other thing is we could go crazy and... I might be able to make a graveyard already. Um... Okay, so these guys... These guys are the killers. What if I try hammer? Come on. Yeah, I like the hammers because they're a little bit faster. But yeah, we should be able to get more than enough medicinal plants here for a fair amount of poultices, which is good. Okay. Just don't want to miss any. I'm really hoping some of these also drop some uh, plum berries along here, all along the way here. But I haven't seen any yet. I mean, they are plum berry trees, but they don't seem to be particularly interested in doing anything. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Yeah, part of the other reason why uh, I kind of put down high school and middle school in favor of college is because I kind of worked my ass off maybe a little bit too much. Um, I guess I'm the kind of person that, like, I really enjoyed... I'm gonna say I really enjoyed my youth. Uh, I had a lot of fun just kind of, like, kicking back and relaxing when I was in uh, in high school and middle school. I played a shit ton of mi uh, RuneScape and such. Um, more than I should have, honestly. Um, but I... Eh, whatever. Terra Incognita, you can make an actually indestructible block. Ooh, fun. Oh, is this big skeleton just here to hunt me? Honestly, he's not really worth fighting, so we're just gonna, going to ignore it for the time being. Looks like he kind of loses interest after a while. Maybe he only spawns from corrupted blocks. No, he's still following me. At least they're very easy to ignore. 41. Do we want to do 42? That's a ton. It's a vault block and not even the player wrecking ball can break it. Uh, how do you get rid of it then? Did I ever loot the chest? Yeah, I think so. Wasn't it a, um... Oh, I don't even remember what it was. Yeah, it was this. No, wait, no, we got the silk from the other guy. It was a recipe for a banner. Uh, not the banner we need, but it was a recipe for a banner. Or west of here. Uh, there was the one in the camp, but I didn't look for the other thing. Yeah, because I'd be a little bit leery about, um... Uh, I'd be a little bit leery about a, uh, a block that I can never break, ever. You have to force monsters to try and spawn underneath them. Eesh. Yeah, bold banner. Bold banner is not what I'm looking for, though. Yeah, I don't see any... I don't know if there's any chests west of here. I haven't looked. Doing a damn good job. Okay. Oh. I got it from the silk... Silk shot. From the magician. Huh. You might be right about then. that then. There's a lot of land to purify out here. I'm kind of committed to doing it though. I mean, we've already done done a fairly bang up job making things not look like garbage around here. Yeah, it doesn't look like the chest is open. I might have forgotten. This pisses me off a bit. Killed him quick, though. Let's put the ash down. There we go. Hey, if we ever want to plant grass, all we have to do is put down some ash blocks and, uh, grass over them. Okay, so we've got plenty of food and a fair amount of healing, and... nothing. Okay, there's definitively nothing in that chest. This is good times. Let's see if I can go get the banner. 
bloodstone would look nice on some some of the floors. Yeah, but I already have like a red carpet. Like the bloodstone seems almost kind of meaningless in the face of like the the finer looking carpets that I can actually fabricate and I believe replace. Oh, it's the big guy this time. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore him for now. Let's see if I can let's see if I can get into this and. Maybe not fight my way through, but give it a go. Oh, right, there's gravestones on here. 